Say what I want like I'm Taylor My back kinda white like Taylor Sweet Taylor yeah. We're back I don't just rap, so we're getting to Samson FTC Give me a down and tell you with those that's traditionally, but in case you know how we get down here at the L Jazz Rag stage, Miss Aphrodite is gonna explain to you. Yeah, y'all. So my name is Aphrodite. Ooh. Hey. And I'm gonna let you know what I think of the video. And if I don't like the video, I'm gonna go in my little stash down here. I'm gonna get my hammer. I'm gonna get my bottle. And I'm gonna knock the bottle. Okay. But if I do like it, what I'm gonna do is take that. Take that thing, hit him with a whoop, whoop, just like that. So let's see what Samson FTC, Samson Bitcoin got for us. Yeah, that's a Bitcoin? That's, no, a, that's, a, that's a cryptocurrency. No, it's BTC, but okay. FTC, BTC. FTC stand up? Watch it. <laughs> <laughs> the sarcasm here is is, is exquisite. <laughs> I can definitely feel the card, the sarcasm. You know what I'm saying? No cap. Bye bye. But I appreciate the message though because I really be trying to also project people that celebrities. I don't even like the word celebrities. Public figures because they are public figures. And whoever is seen as celebrity is, is a public figure. So you know you're just publicly f figured. You know what I'm saying? People look at you as a public as a public of view. Like your opinion is public, and people are able to to. Uh, critique it or or whatever what have you you know what I'm saying but I but I do believe that people should put less emphasis on what a public figure says and just take it into account and you can use it to also help you formulate your own opinion but people literally will just blindly follow a public figure's opinion which is like also create your own opinion just use different opinions to help you create your own but like don't just blindly follow somebody else's opinion like just because they they like have more money than you or because they have more stature it doesn't make any sense to me i think a lot because some of these people like we just reacted to an upchurch song the man says i'm the leader you shouldn't follow <laughs> man said i'm a leader you shouldn't follow yeah and you shouldn't be following a lot of these people facts yeah make your own decisions you know what like like me personally i don't know if i would be on camera looking like this half naked you know what i'm saying me personally though you, you know? just woke up i think that's the vibe you know i feel them though it'd be like that Old intellectual, so intelligible, I have trouble keeping up with them. They deserve gold medals. They have such big heads, and I don't mean egotistical. I mean that the brains are so big, it's probably hard for it to even fit in their skull. And that's why they're always high, strong, and freaking out at the paparazzi. It ain't because they're mean, it's just because their brain's so goddamn big that it's always throbbing. We're constantly solving our country's problems. Huh. What would we do without them? I don't know. We'd be stuck on a big piece of land that nobody here has a clue how to run. We'd be fucked. And how would you know who to vote for without somebody telling you? You probably have to do your own research. Now, that's bullshit you don't want to delve into. Uh, you probably have to go and actually look at the policies of each individual candidate to make sure y'all agree and see if you'd be cool with everything they would do. Because if they fuck up, who's paying for it? You, who? us, Damn. ordinary civilians. Look at the debt. We're buried in trillions. Their children are going to be set. I kind of feel like this tooth, this like bathroom scene could have been shorter. <laughs> yeah, it could have been a clip because the toothpaste thing is distracting. Yeah, I'm like, I'm honestly not even really paying attention to what he's saying because like there's so much toothpaste foam <laughs> flying everywhere, like yeah. heavy. The one, the first foam. scene was enough when I was yeah. like, what? I need to see yeah. it again. And the shock value already happened. I'm like, okay, cool, shock <laughs> value. Ah, toothpaste. No. Right. So um, yeah, word though, like stop. <laughs> like, you can stop now. Us, ordinary civilians, look at the debt. We're buried in trillions. Their children are gonna be set. But yours, they ain't inheriting millions. I don't know, man. Everyone has an opinion. But who in their right minds would trust somebody who acts for a living? The ones who are posting on Twitter, you ain't in my circle if you fake. Are the same ones who take life advice from people that are literally two faced. I got a toothache because I'm always biting my tongue. If I don't stop, I'll chew through the bitch. Yes, everybody has an opinion, but yours happens to be stupid as shit. The ones who live the most privileged life are the very last ones that should give advice. It's easy to tell little folks what to do when you're up top looking at the city lights. You and I are told. I ain't I'm confused by why, why he chose. What is up to, with the aesthetic? Here? Yeah, like, like the sloppiness is the mood board me is interesting. Is he trying? To, <laughs> what is? Is he trying to be like, look like an everyday guy that 
made it? Like, what is going on? Could be that. Like, he's trying to, like, he's kind of denouncing celebrity while, I guess, trying to show the regular life individual. Yeah. That eats hot dogs with mustard and, and brushes their it. teeth and, like, spills it. Like, I mean, you could at least eat over the table. Like, you know, y- y- it was dripping me. from the hot dog. You didn't have to put that much mustard. Hashtag no dogs. No hot Not dogs. dogs. Not dogs. Not dogs. Yeah, don't eat hot dogs. Not guys. dogs. Twerk for Burke. Vice, it's easy to tell little folks what to do when you're up top looking at the city lights. You and I are total polar opposites. I'm a nobody, no one knows I exist. You're a multi-million dollar mogul making loads of money. If you want it, you buy it. I gotta second guess myself if I wanna go splurge and buy Chick-fil-A. The amount I can save if I went to Wendy's is a big deal to me. It's like night and day. Why the hell would I listen to you? I'm broke as I felt well, that though. I mean I feel you though, but like let's go for the quality though. The quality meats. You feel me? We want quality meats. First of all, I don't support Chick Fil A, but it is also quality expensive. Mince. I got the app. Uh, I don't know if you know. You might have to download your own app, Samson. Um, <laughs> but I got the app personally, um, Chick Fil A app. I'm a Silver member. <laughs> oh wow! Right. Yeah, you know. committed. I ain't gonna lie. I think it reset though. I think it's only by a year, so I'm kind of upset. I think I went oh. back down. But uh, it's all good though. At some point, I rack it back up. You know what I'm saying? But. You buy it. I gotta second guess myself if I wanna go splurge and buy Chick fil A. The amount I can save if I went to Wendy's is a big deal to me. It's like night and day. Why the hell would I listen to you? I'm broke as fuck and you're filthy rich. Nothing affects you the way it affects me, so I don't wanna hear your silly shit. Fuck you. I don't buy into your fake smile whenever you talk to the camera. Listen to you? I'd rather have Governor watch my grandma. You live in a bubble, it's been a minute since you went through the struggle. You lost your touch, you must be off that stuff. If you think you and I have things in common, fuck your pretentious self. Nobody asked you for your hand or to lend your help. If you want everything to be so equal, then hey, how about you spread the wealth? You gotta lie, you don't need all that. Folks on the block, they get feed off that. Instead of endorsing people you don't know shit about, how about you fork it up and give a little back? Give a little. I ain't talking about giving out turkeys. No, I'm talking about big amounts, earnings. Walk the streets and start handing out bonds of relief instead of just interviewing bitch. Look at all these activists. Y'all must be college graduates. I wonder what kind of law you practice. So do you just study politics? I'm asking because you know so much. No, you don't. I speak on behalf of a vast majority. We don't want to hear you lecture us about shit. Don't act like you have authority. Please don't. Just act accordingly. Yes. Stick to acting and rapping horribly. Yes. You're so detached from normalcy. Nothing you say is that important to me. I ain't talking about all of them, though. This is just a select few. There's also a lot that work in silence. And just so you know, I respect you. The stage you accept your Oscar on in a platform for you to talk so long. Nope. Take your trophy and shove it up your ass. Say thank you and keep on walking along. The moment that I become famous and rich and I'm living the life of Riley. When it comes to politics, I'll shut the fuck up. Because I know that. He usually doesn't, though. And this is a year ago. He still, like he still was talking hot. <laughs> yeah, he still was talking hot from then on. So well, I don't know if he's rich and famous yet. Uh, yeah. But he still was talking hot from then on, so I don't know. I think he's that person that will still talk hot. Even Politically, though? Because he said he wouldn't oh, yeah, talk yeah, yeah, yeah. on politics. No, literally, I remember there's a video I did. It was earlier this year. And I just, as I'm recording, like, I just be in a different zone sometimes. Yeah. So he had said something about Dr. Fauci. And I was like, who's Dr. Fauci? Who's Fauci? Or I don't think he said Dr. Fauci. He said Fauci. And I was like, who's Fauci? They ripped me apart. <laughs> like, ripped me to shreds. Oh. Who's Fauci? Look at this dumbass. You know what I'm like, damn, bro. Like, because after I was doing the video, I was like, oh, wait, that's Fauci. But I was like, I mean, whatever. I'm about to put it out. I don't care. Put the video out. It was ripping me. But that was a little earlier this year, you know? So he was still talking hot about it. You know what I'm saying? His, his opinions. Maybe he doesn't think he's famous yet, so he's still mm-hmm. being opinionated. I have thoughts on the whole celebrity thing now. Like, 400K. That's enough. Yeah. have influence. Enough to have influence facts, but uh, to be famous, no. No, yeah. Not famous. No. Love it up your ass, say thank you, and keep on walking along. The moment that I become famous and rich and I'm living the life of Riley, when it comes to politics, I'll shut the fuck up. Because I know that most situations won't apply to me. We got him. Fuck you. Yeah, he's a thinker. Yeah. Well, he's, he's a out thinker. Here Go fuck yourself. You want us to kill him or pay him? Oh. Wow. Damn. That was deep. That was deep. Whoa. Wow. That got even more deep. Nice. 
FTC on all platforms. Wow. Headshot though? Wow. Damn, that got deep. Yeah, <laughs> that got deep. That, that, how <laughs> that got real deep, boy. I ain't gonna lie. That's crazy. Since uh, he's a thinker. That's yeah. how that I be. I think that's what they. Well, that's not what they did because they covered it up as suicide. But I feel like that's the what they pulled with the the three founders of cryptocurrency. Yeah. Mm -hmm. but you know jacket. what? I'm not even going. I ain't even. It's fine. I don't want no smoke. I'm not <laughs> a thinker. I don't want no smoke. <laughs> Trust me. I don't want it. You got it. Just leave me alone, please. You know what I'm saying? Don't worry, though. Um, I may have my thoughts here and there, but hey, whatever it is, it's not that aggressive. You know what I'm saying? No worries. <laughs> we don't gotta, gotta, gotta up it like that. I'm you not know, a picket like... fencer. I don't even go to protest. You know what I'm saying? No worries, <laughs> I ain't never been to no protest. I ain't never no, been to no protest. No march, no riot, no I don't no be nothing. marching. Keep you know? Peace. When people was uh, out there looting and protesting, it wasn't me. You know what I'm saying? I was actually walking past one of those one time to to I was walking past I was in Soho walking past one of the protests and it was looting and stuff and I was on my way to a hotel trying to put money into the environment and the economy. You know what I'm saying? You see what I'm doing? You see what I'm doing? You know what I'm saying? Word. Not with no smoke, but yeah, I want you to let me know how you feel about that. Yeah, um, that was cool. You know, honestly, at the beginning, I thought the FTC was part of his name. FTC stand up. That's why I thought it was Samson FTC. I thought that was his whole name. But FTC, oh, does that mean fuck the celebrities? Is that what it Ooh, stands for? Okay. You're on the roll today. <laughs> yeah. I'm trying, I got the. Could the, be. The, 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 I see you're a thinker. The, 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 yeah, sometimes. Ooh. It just stutters sometimes. You know, I don't know if you want, you want to tone that. <laughs> they might come find you behind the car with the. Nah, but although I have my own responses to maybe the general topic of what he was talking about, like. I get what he means because there's definitely a lot of people who talk on things they don't actually know anything about and then mm. people just take it and run with it. So everyone's just talking information that's not backed by anything. Mm. But on the counter side, I feel like I do follow a lot of people who I've seen come up. who I, The celebrities I like, I feel like I relate to. So that's why I might like care about their opinion or want to hear what they have to say. So like... When you're talking about just the celebrities that you don't relate to, it's kind of like, yeah, like I don't care about your opinion because I don't relate to you and you're just famous and everyone just praises you. But I feel like now at this point in my life, there's celebrities that I've seen come up when they weren't famous and now they are and they're using their platform to talk about stuff. And I think they should. And I do think it's important for people to talk about important stuff. Like if I know I don't know anything about politics, I'm not going to talk about politics just because, you know what I mean? But um, I do think it's important to have those kind of conversations and then it's like well you know he was talking about oh you when the when he was talking about how their brains are so big and the paparazzi and the they said that it's kind of like well if i have paparazzi at that point i probably had to act a certain way you know what i mean or like i don't know but anyways besides my take on the topic i do think it was a pretty good video we had a lot of comments it kept me engaged is what i'll say like i was definitely listening but there was also parts of the visual that were just like mad toothpaste and all that stuff yeah, like it was going off mustard brown nipples like there was a lot brown you seen nipples yeah you just, i mean yeah <laughs> Yeah, like, me. <laughs> in there. and then yeah it had a bigger meaning you had the whole drama at the end it was cool i'm not mad at it samson i would listen to another one and he could he got bars he could rap he, no, he could rap, rap though he, he could rap, rap. that's why I, I, I i'm not gonna give him the bars but i am gonna give him the rap he could rap he got a flow to him he's cool and he said we had to say and he ain't care you know i like that samson i could get with you for that so i'm gonna have to pull that thing out and give you one of these samson you got it. FTC. You got it. You got it. <laughs> Flight team stand up. But uh, we outside. I do agree. Sam's a good rap. And he was talking. He was talking facts, though. Like, we got to stop putting so much uh, uh, emphasis. emphasis on these public figures and celebrities' yeah. opinions. Like, just create your own opinion and go with, go with that, you know. And you can take other people's. You can be influenced by other people's opinions and whatnot. But uh, it's more important to have your yeah. own be thought informed. process. You know what I'm saying? Look it up. Ask Google, not yeah. Instagram, and not Twitter. Don't ask Siri either, cause she's gonna log, she gonna log everything you say, and it's over. Come you know they come and they spin it back. You know what I'm saying? They spin it back, but right. I don't got me. You know, I turned off my Siri, turned off my um, my, my, well, I got an Alexa in the crib, but hopefully it's off. I look like <laughs> worse than Siri if you ask me. Hey, I don't like any of them. <laughs> I'm I'm all of them, K. You know what I'm right. saying? No cap. Yeah, but we outside with those getting down and dirty. Make sure you go ahead and subscribe to the channel. Turn on the post notification bell so every time we drop a new damn video, make sure you follow Taylor L. Jazz on TikTok and Instagram for more funny and satirical content. Let them know where they can find you at. 
Yes, y'all, my name is Aphrodite, and I spell it with an F, so make sure you follow me on Instagram at aphrodite.bk. Because your girl is from Brooklyn, make sure you tap into the music I have out already, and stay tuned for some really cool events and pictures and interviews that I have coming this year. Yes, sir, we all saw those. Ladies, my name is Taylor L. Jackson, watching L. Jackson Ranch. Big Reaper, and I'm back for the killing. When I get on the track, say what I'm